been a while since I played. I think it's like a week and a half or something compared to like the every day I was doing during the event or almost every day. Uh, I've stopped doing dailies and the fragile resin thingies, original resin, what, what is this shit called? That, whatever that is. I stopped doing that about uh, two weeks ago. I got sick of doing dailies. I got sick of doing the stupid resin. I did it every day for about three weeks straight. So I think I'm entitled to get bored of it very easily. So I've stopped doing that. So Add Astra. I don't know what level we can get to, but I don't care at this point. I need, I just need to not for quite some time because three weeks is a long time to be playing the same game every day doing the same boring things every day it's not even like it was interesting or you know different so there's that i don't remember what i said i was going to do last time i honestly don't know um i don't really know where we're at <laughs> probably should have watched the end of my last video to figure out what's happening and where i'm at from a character perspective, it looks like everybody seems to be at level 65, even um, Xing Chu, which means I must have gotten the masks I needed. I say this as if I don't remember it. <laughs> I got the masks, okay? I got the masks. Yay me. So there is that. I could put them straight to 70, but, you know, they do get minimal XP when you fight things sometimes, so there's no point taking all the way up when you can slowly chip away at that. I mean, it's like barely gonna make a difference but you know still so uh new event ish i wouldn't really call it a new event but you get extra shit don't know can't be bothered uh story chapter i can't do because i'm not high enough we can however try out hu tao so let's go get our pyro on and although i'm, I'm hoping to get hu tao my party it doesn't really matter because I can't level her up. I only just got enough level up material to level up Bennett. So it would be ages until I can get her to level. Gag the description. God, I've only just started and my throat already hurts. I have not been in a good place the past few weeks with my uh, throat and the dry weather and the fans. Ugh. Though it's actually quite humid today and raining. When Hu Tao casts her elemental skills, she consumes a said proportion of HP. Ugh. One of these HP consumption idiots, okay. And enters into Paramita Papilio. What does it even mean? It should become like a freaking butterfly. In which her normal attacks, charge attacks, pff, who even uses those? And plunging attacks, see previous point, deal pyro damage. So she has a normal attack until she uses her E ability, which therefore she loses HP, but then she starts doing pyro damage with her normal attacks. Okay. In Paramita Papilio state, who tells charged attacks? It's like they just make up words and throw them at you and expect them to be okay. Who tells charged attacks? Don't use them. Apply the blood blossom status to opponents, periodically dealing pyro damage. And yeah, it's not going to start making me use charge attacks. When Hu Tao casts her elemental burst, hitting opponents restores her HP. Yes, but what's a cooldown? When Hu Tao's HP is less than 50%, hits still increase damage and restore more HP. Eh. I'd like to hope that she doesn't get down there that frequently. Additional elemental ores will drop during the trial event to challenge. This is not exactly a realistic challenge then, is it? If you're going to give me extra One shit. Clients, two clients, three clients. So this lady here, oh, interesting um, hair at the back of her head, the way it's layered like that. This lady, I don't know if she owns the funeral parlor, but she's essentially Zhongli's boss, I think. I think. It's weird because she looks really young and I'm pretty sure Jung Lee is like huh? ageless. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Oh god, what's with your eyes? This girl is not normal. Okay. Pretty basic get up, but kinda nice, kinda somber in a good way, given her One profession. Client. Two okay, who tell? Oh, Jesus Christ, she really is butterfly mode. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so she has some sort of fascination with butterflies, apparently. Oh, even look at her ear, Billy, it even looks like it. Start challenge. This one not timed. Okay. E. Charge attacks, you say. Oh, she goes through them. If I hold it. Well, that's kind of neat. It is fire, good. Fire, fire. Jesus Christ. 
but I have to listen to that every single time. <laughs> I haven't checked how much HP it actually is. I mean, she moves around on the field a lot. Sorry, I'm trying to use the Q ability, but it wasn't even right. Time to go. It's hard to target specific enemies, to be honest with you, because she kind of just goes in her own direction. You kind of just hold it and hope for the best. That's interesting. It looks cool. I like that she's using a pole arm because we currently have nobody using one. I like pole arms. I very much like pole arms. But it, oh, it's it's weird not being able to really target a specific person. You just sort of press it and hope for the best. God, I almost did what I do every single time and hit try again. <laughs> uh, you can also try uh, Xingqiu and Zhongyun, but since I've got them both in my party, I cannot be bothered, even though we get rewards. Cannot be bothered. So, we've got a lot of cluster Fs going on here. Uh, let us start from the bottom and work our way up because I, I just, I don't want to go there. <laughs> An Adeptal Summons. If you wish to meet Cloud Retainer again, you must prepare a food offering. I didn't know that I wanted to meet Cloud Retainer again. Offer the delicious jury soup. Okay, apparently I have one on me already. Who knew? Let's go back to this. Cloud Retainer. Were you the stag? I don't remember which one you were, to be honest. It's been a long time, but we finally get to finish the story. Or at the very least, we finally... Bloody mountains. I have the opportunity to continue with the story. Now that we are appropriate level. I really don't remember which one you were. Oh, don't we go for it here and then we go into the mountain or something like that? I don't know. Jean, do you remember? I don't remember. Wow, I didn't record it all yesterday. Why is my throat so sore when talking minimally? Am I, am I projecting my voice too much? Would not surprise me. Yeah, that'd be a thing. I thought it just, it was assuming that I already had one the way it was phrasing it, but no. I don't. Fine then, I'll go get myself some jury bloody soup. What's in it, by the way, and do I have the ingredients? It's a very important question. Uh, yeah, that's not the interact button. That'd be the elemental button. Oh, whoopsies. I put it out, so I'm so sorry. The whole reason I went here was because I didn't have to light it. And then I go and just, like, put out the goddamn fire. What you, an idiot. Shut what? up. Okay. Let's try that again. I am pitiful, I know. Or pathetic. Good choice. For justice. Alright. So... Now that we're hitting the correct interact button, ooh, we've got a northern apple stew recipe. Restores max HP. Ooh, that seems epic. Can we make some of those? N no, I need butter and pepper. Anyway, we're not here for that. We are here for <sighs> tofu. Frickin' tofu. Yo, sir, tofu a lady up, would ya? I feel like having tofu, sir. Tofu, tofu. You don't have, I hate you. I mean, why not? It's not like I know what they do until I purchase them, so. Maybe there's better health foods that I don't know about. Bye. I'll come back once I go to this dude over here, who I believe sells to. I think he does. I've been able to buy stuff from him before. Yeah. Are you supposed to be the general vendor? I don't think you give. I could have sworn that dude has given me tofu before for that almond tofu thing. 
Oh no, it was you. My apologies. Purchase up to a hundred. No, thank you, sir. I just need two. But can I learn the recipes here or do I hit the wrong button? Or do I have to do it at the... 818! That's fine. Can you please clear them out of my inventory? Where are they? I think it's cleared. Yeah, it has. Thankfully, where the hell did I pick up a bamboo shoot from? Where did I get the ba Found in the wild. How? Is my question. I don't even know what half the shit does. So 20% makes an additional 1200, 24% and 1500. So the delicious sweet madame is better than a standard ass sweet madame. Do I get that by doing it manually? It doesn't really specify. Matsudake meat rolls. That actually sounds alright. Mushroom meat rolls. I'll take. Okay, they do literally the exact same thing, which is nice. That's also kind of nice. Nutritious meal. Revise the selected. Oh my gosh. It's blue. Oh my gosh, I've got blue stuff. Eh, wouldn't anyone use that? Uh, no, there's no recipes there. So I guess we've just got to go back to old mate. I just didn't know if I needed to buy more parts in case I wanted to make some of the new recipes. Uh, do any of my characters have any proficiencies with cooking? I don't actually know. Okay, well that's grey. Useless. It's green. Green is good. Eh. I mean, if re regen's nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like regen. Oh my. Oh my. This does a lot. You are literally the exact same thing. Okay, well let's just get this done before we forget. Okay, it says someone does get a bonus. Noel! Enching Yan. When a perfect cooking is achieved on defense boosting dish, this is a defense boosting dish, whatever. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Let's go for the crazy lady. She's just got crazy looking hair. Yay! Can I cook anything else though? No, I need extra food. I need rice. But to be fair, I don't have any lotus heads. I don't make a habit of picking up lotus heads. Oh god, or tomatoes apparently. Where do you even get tomatoes from? Oh, you have to buy them? That seems very impractical. And that's a nice use of my small lump lamp grass, which I barely do anything. Where do I get fish from? Gotta be catching fish. Gosh, that's rare. Okay, so it's like the Monstat version of it. So we just need a shit ton of butter and pepper, right? Shit ton of butter and pepper coming right up. Nope, not you. I don't like you. Butter and pepper. Just check I can get the butter. <gasps> Where do I get butter from? Did old mate around the corner sell butter? He might have. Ten. Wanna make ten of this dish if I can? Because why not? Yeah, butter! I need butter. Sir, do you have butter on you? I feel like butter. Okay, I don't know where I'm getting butter from. That's a problem. Ah, oh, this doesn't tell me recipes. Butter. Processed. What does that even mean? I don't know what that means. Like at all. Processed. What does processed mean? I feel like I've got a recipe for butter. Okay, I forgot there's a second tab. I forgot there's a second tab on this because I never do this. Butter. We need a shit ton of milk. 
Okay, I don't know if that might solve milk. Probably not. Let us go over here and buy some milk. Uh, it was two milk to one butter, so we'd need 20 milk. Right? Right milk. 20. Damn, it's expensive milk. 2,000 more. Jesus, this is the most expensive food I've ever made. Processed. Me butter. Me butter. Mm -hmm. Oh, we just. Oh, no! Okay, fuck that. Goodbye. I'm gonna leave and forget that that was a thing I was even doing. Next! Lucha landscape. Ah, this is for Vermeer. And it takes me to the location. So. If you recall, I did mention this. You guys didn't see it because it was off screen. I was getting, who knows what I was getting. Could have been rock deposits at some point in time, mineral deposits. But I ran into Vermeer out in the middle of nowhere. According to Vermeer, his lost paints and brushes are at a viewing spot that he previously visited. If you examine the two paintings carefully, you should be able to figure out where he painted them. Oh, that's right. It doesn't navigate. I'm supposed to look at the paintings. Yep, yeah, okay. What paintings are these? I don't know what paintings were for these paintings. Okay. Read. Am I supposed to know where the hell that is? Because I can assure you I don't. I've been there because I remember the statues. Couldn't tell you where it is, not in a million years. It's near some pools, which I definitely will not be able to see from the sky. What's that? No, it's not that one. It wasn't that. God, that was traumatic. I did that off camera as well. <laughs> it's a bit of a puzzle. Well, hold on. Hold on. Let's just go up here. I just want to know what the, the pools look like at uh, Chingsa. Um, it doesn't really show you the pools. Okay. Yeah, don't know where we're going. I've never paid enough attention to the Leo and landscape to be able to differentiate all the different parts. We may Google this one. I am out of patience and I just started, so yeah. What's this quest actually called? Lihua? No, Luhua. Is Luhua a place? Luhua, 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 Luhua. Ahaha. Ahaha. So, somewhere over here. Are the books and the pictures specifically. Oh, there's something on my keyboard. Get off my keyboard. I bet you it's chocolate. Yeah, it looks like white chocolate. Why does it always sound like you're saying chop suey? It sounds terrible. Uh, okay. Now, where am I going? Yeah, at the viewing spot. So is this the viewing spot, one assumes? So then it would be this. It would be over here. Here-ish. Somewhere. Um, that's a big area of margin. Big area of margin. Oh, God. Um, yeah. Could it even be up here somewhere? Oh yeah, boom. That was easy. <laughs> that was uh, really easy. Right, here we are. This should be the spot that was used as a scene in the painting. Well, yeah, but... Oh, there. Boom. Are these the paints the artist is looking for? So many colours. Well, let's get them back to the artist and see what he says. Yay. Well, that one was easier. I didn't realise that the books were actually in the picture. I thought that was just like an addition to the um, painting. I don't really remember these pools. They're very nice. What's the other one look like? Oh, this is the same thing, just on a different angle. Ah, oh, that's like... Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's over there somewhere. Where specifically though? What kind of angle are we looking at? It's just off front on. 
was just checking if there's a quicker way to get across. Can't tell if it's there or there. It's just off front on, so I'm thinking it is here, in which case I'd be better off just going myself the way I am. Very slowly, in other words. Hmm. Damn stamina. <clears throat> Jesus. Hello. I don't need you. Oh, that was a bad idea. Sorry, I have something stuck in my throat. It's really uncomfortable. <clears throat> so I would have said over here. <gasps> but that does not appear to be the case. Therefore, it must be up there. Oh, yeah. I suppose this isn't around enough. Should I go across and climb or should I just fast travel into there? I'm thinking fast traveling into there. Might be cooker. Unless it's on the base ground and I have to climb anyway, in which case, no, it would not be cooker. I'm so glad that this ah uh, was called Luhua Landscapes. Otherwise, I would not know where I was going or what I was doing. Here we go. Okay, where's this shit? Back corner. How do you lose your stuff, by the way? Oh, we actually met him over there. <laughs> Shows how much I remembered. I can't make it there. I might be able to make it to there. Nope, nope, I'm gonna fall short. Oh, I remember this place, and then we went down and we got something. We had to unlock it by doing those in a certain order, uh, by which one still had pillars. That's right. No one in a million years would figure it out for themselves. That doesn't look very stable. And I'm coming for Mia. After I get attacked by Electra Slimes. I'm coming. There he is. Oh, that's right. And the thing I can't unlock because I don't know how. Yeah, so I don't know how to get in there. It looks there are chests in there if memory serves. I don't know how to get in here. Look at all that. And I can't get in because I can't figure out how to unlock this damn geo thing. Grr. How frustrating. Do you by chance know how to get in? Have you found my painting tools? Found them. Just as I thought. I left them in the place I was taking references from. I tend to put the things I've used on the ground while I paint out of habit. When I'm in too much of a rush, I tend to leave a lot of things behind. That sounds very impractical and makes you very scatterbrained. Thank you so much. If not for you, I'd have to go back into the city to buy more. You going to continue painting here? Don't even mention it. I'd heard people say that these two statues have eyes that could light up and that you could see from afar. Giant statues with blazing eyes, standing guard next to a mountain. It surely would surely have made an excellent painting. When I came here, the statues were here, but there were no shining eyes to be found. I thought that I might have missed some special timing, or that my anger was off, which is why I've been walking around. But it seems that what, no matter where I stand, the scenery doesn't change. The only thing I've gotten out of the whole venture is this. I found it in the pond down there. I have no clue what it is, but the more I look at it, the more it resembles an eye. But if this is an eye, then there might be another similar rock nearby. People do have two eyes after all. <sighs> That's my conjecture anyway. Don't think too hard about it. This rock's of little use to me anyway, so why don't you have it? Consider it thanks for helping me find my tools. Statues with shining eyes. I wonder what secrets one can uncover in Luhua Pool. But I can't swim underground, under, under, underwater. Strange stone. Look for another strange rock. <sighs> you even have faces. <clears throat> Ooh. 
Is it going to be in the water? I'm just wondering if that light going over there was where we're supposed to be going, but I don't think it is. I think it's outside the search area. Oh no, this is where we're going. Yeah. I'll take that. Get some lotus head. Yeah, nobody got time for you. Actually, I do have time for you a lot. God, I'm so overpowered for this world. <laughs> I need to level up my world. We'll get there. We'll get there. You guys are adorable. Yeah, you guys can act. Witness to me. Submit for judgment. Wow, I'm sorry, babe. Though you were pretty redundant by that point. My apologies. Hey, we got another one. Unravel the secret behind Luhua Pool. Kind of shove them in, in its face. Is that practical? <laughs> Here, statue, take. Yeah. What? Oh. I don't go to the... Uh, the mirror. This isn't right. That can't be right. The statue's eyes don't light up. Yeah, but... Do you want me to climb a statue? It doesn't seem very practical, but there's literally nowhere else I can put these things. Okay, sir. So I apologize in advance. This is going to get a little questionable. I'm gonna have to go up your uh, your, your your spear first. Nice phallic reference. I'm gonna have to climb your spear. And then find a way from there. I thought that would be the case, but guess what? We're gonna do that. Even though my stamina is a little iffy, this is what we're doing. <clears throat> now, if you don't mind, can I shove this in your face? I told you you don't have a face! I was right! The statue's head has a hole in her head, and it seems something may be inserted into- wait, what hole? You mean this whole thing? Insert. Submit. Give. Oh, you just lob the whole thing in like that. Okay, that's definitely not what I was thinking. Um, yeah, we might climb the cloak. Might be easier. Hey, treasure hoarders! That's why I was here, I think. I was killing treasure hoarders. Yeah, look at my map. I've marked it as uh, enemies to kill. I was definitely here for treasure hoarders. And in she goes. Does this, does this mean I can use the geoth? Yes! Come here, gate! I am determined to open you. Oh, you just plot me down the ground. I was going to take out the treasure hunters, but sure. Hoarders. Whatever. Oh, so that's how it is. These two rocks really are the eyes of those two statues. Their eyes will only shine once you've slotted the stones in. Looks like I'll be able to paint something great after all. I'm off to find a good angle. Thank you so much. No, thank you, buddy. I wouldn't have thought about shoving them in their faces, so... Good points for that. Ning Guan Guang There's a G there. There's, there's a G there, isn't there? Yeah, sorry, Ning Guang. My apologies. Don't disappoint I completely me. destroyed your name. Oh shit! Oh shit! But I don't have any good characters on me! Oh god damn it. I got I got rid of Jung Yun! Barbados! Well, let's just hope that, you know, my uh, high power characters are enough to are enough to do it. Your cooldown takes forever. Doesn't matter, you're dead. Hey hey. Challenge completed. Now I get these pretty dancing swords around me. Pretty useless at this point in time. Ningguang. Switch up. Time for some training? And that's why you're supposed to level all your characters. 
Oh no, I foresee problems right in these corners. Nope. Nope, not you. You. No. I keep going to fall. I'm used to Chung Yun being on four. Can you just stop jumping forward and just stand there, please, and attack? You're making life difficult for yourself. Just stand. This is absolutely useless. That is not the one I hit. That is a button I hit. And this big one in the center. Luxurious chest. I'm assuming that all that stuff is like uber important. Yay! I'm so glad we figured this out. It was bothering me.